Today is a day I really did not want to face off the last episode of Interspecies Reviewers. It has been such a cultural and educational piece of anime that I feel that the adventure should never end. However, we still have unexplored species, which hopefully we will see in this episode. So let us get into the season finale of Interspecies Reviewers. If you guys want to watch along, be sent the video in 3, 2, 1, let's go. Oh, maybe we'll kind of have a recap. I love how they have like all the business cards for them. I thought last week's episode was kind of... <laughs> They're always probing about something. I thought we were used to that now. I thought last week was kind of the recap-ish episode with kind of the um, Incubus re-reviewing the girls. She was indeed cute. Oh, what do they write about you? They never went. <laughs> Oh my god, are we actually going to go into the plot? That's actually a pretty cool kind of adventure there. Oh no! Oh, does he take forever? Oh, crew. <laughs> That's me at work. I'm awake. I'm fully awake. <laughs> We're not gonna get Krim in the season finale? <laughs> okay, I'm excited to explore this joy, and I do understand that Krim's an angel, so demons, like, doesn't work out, but still. It's the season finale, and I don't get to see my boy Crib. Oh, that booty shot. <laughs> when you gotta suck up to your boss. <laughs> we actually finally get to see the... Demons. Oh wow, you got big ones, small ones, really small ones. They really do come in all sizes. I knew fucking Stuck was gonna pick her. I like this. I like the variety though. This is, this is quick. Ooh, it was quite fancy. <gasps> Stout looks hot as fuck with his hair down. What the fuck? Wait, did he always have so much hair? I'm so confused. I guess he did have it in a bun. Does that mean you guys like to be? Yeah, I was gonna say, is that a fetish? At least you're very honest. Yep. Is this going to be a lesson about how to propose to a demon? Okay, take notes, boys. Take notes. <laughs> I think she'll hate it. Damn, okay. 
So you'll make she'll make you into a bitch. Wow, so it's just a couple of words. I thought it'll be Okay, so demons are very particular about wording. I guess that is true. Oh shit. Wait, does that mean we don't get to fuck in the party? I'm just making sure. I think, he, okay, he he has always been a smart boy. That that actually makes a lot of sense. Okay, Zell looks hot with hair wet as well. I'm just saying, it's a different look. I just didn't expect. <laughs> they got a little bit distracted by Moo. <laughs> They should so play Doja Cat's new hair. Bitch, I'm a cow. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a cow. <laughs> Wait, we're gonna go back, right? At least it was a pretty high rating, but you gotta make sure you get a good, like, contract. Wow, you could get pretty kinky with a contract though, I'm just thinking. You have to be very- I think you have to pretty much write down like exactly what you want from your waifu, your demon waifu. Or maybe this will help with the political stuff. What, 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 who, huh? Oh, it's her? Why does she look so big? Or is that just like perception? I love how they never thought of this. That's pretty troll. <laughs> that censoring. Hmm? Ooh, it's her. Demia. Will make my life so much easier. Why are we getting so much plot in the season finale? Oh, is this. Are we going there? Okay. Oh, she's asking for some device for um, Crim's milk. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry, but the version I'm watching, I feel like is missing subs, so I'm struggling to follow. <laughs> she 
ist der Typ ist das so? God damn it, what I need the subs. Okay, airplanes are indeed cool. Oh, wow. So they know of like our world. Wait, so does this confirm that like a stunk is stunk on Isekai? Oh, okay, she's talking about protection. <laughs> okay, I don't 100% catch on to everything because some of the subs were missing, which I didn't know this version. Like, something must have happened with the file, but... Oh my god, Krim is still there. You poor boy. You poor, poor sweetie. <gasps> Bring the life back in crew. The dead eyes of a patient angel day seven. Imagine sitting there for seven days. Oh, Krim needs to go back to the succubus brothel. <laughs> I still can't get over that shot. Like, just, oh, just don't do this to me. Anyways. The bar scene was actually really hot, but I was, like, distracted by all the subs. But, like, with hot subs not also being there. Oh, it's the new year! What's this happening? What's this? What's this? What's this way? This way? No, I think that's the other way. <laughs> what is everyone doing? Oh, we're gonna get cultured! Oh, we're praying to the gods for the new year! Oh, rip. <laughs> You're gonna destroy a whole goddamn religion. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was a bit savage. Brothel time. <laughs> no, it's definitely not putting together a resolution. Start the new year with a bag. You gotta go to the girls. You right. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. All right. <laughs> oh, we don't get to see Demi again. Oh, so this is going to be kind of like a, not not exactly a recap. I guess more of a, like a revisit. Who did you write highly? Yeah. No, no. This is like episode one and two. The chippies. Oh, sorry, what was that? <laughs> I feel like your shop's gonna be the BDSM one. Oh, the goalie shop. Oh yeah, because you were really good at crafts. Ooh, ooh, that that's cool. That's is that meant to be Zell? Do you want to get killed? Yep. 
I'm sorry, Mary, but you're already a default doll. <laughs> Who is Crim's top? Oh, <gasps> yes, as well as um the hyena, Elsa. The polar bear. Okay, that was kind of cute. Cute, but not for me. Not I, yeah. I could I could see it with the doggo. Oh wow, we're gonna go and redo all our top. <gasps> They're all closed because it's New Year's. Are you for reals? It's our favorite fairy. Why is business booming? I feel like she's half being absolutely savage. Yeah, everyone's got their own thing. I thought that's pretty cool. I think everyone just wants an opinion. Mm, like accurate information, honest opinion. Because like, your scores are more like personal stuff. I love how she's savage. <gasps> ooh, ooh, forbidden place? It came out of boobs, of course it'll be. I love how we're talking about the first fuck in like such an important matter. A body job. <laughs> Excuse me, that fairy is a lot of number one to a lot of people. Are we going to get something unexplored? <gasps> it's meant to be! I ship this so much. <laughs> I ship, sail the ship. Oh, they're all here. Wait, did Alloway plan this? Or maybe this is like VIP brothel. Oh, they're not the real deal. Whoa! I didn't expect it to. I mean, we all got zero problems with that. So everyone's number one is just here. Wow. Oh no, it's a dream place. You know what? I'm still happy with that. <laughs> I mean, you get to redo Debbie. Nope, no, nope, I'm good, thank you. Oh, no. Nope. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, everyone's got their kinks. I respect it. But there's like a limit for me on some things. Oh, you can do the dream eater as well. This place is pretty sweet then. Oh, we're going to go full on. 
there's so much fluff i don't know what bit is which so i think that's why oh okay you got titties as well okay that's cool that's cool <laughs> my innocent view of fucking polar bears i'll never watch polar bear documentaries the same oh oh and that's why his name is Krim. Okay, it's so official. Oh, that is a little depressing. I think that's a bit more accepting than like when Demia breaks up with you. Definitely furry. <laughs> Oh, she was looking forward to it. Okay, I like that as well because it keeps it within like, I mean, like you can dream. Oh, that is, I'm sorry, but whenever Mary's like thick thighs and she stomps on you, that could be a brothel in itself. Like, no fucking, just her stomping on you. It's just her thighs. It's just like that power and she's hot. Is someone transforming? Wait, what the fuck? Did you become so ancient? <gasps> wait, why? Wait, I'm so confused as to why we're trying on this transformation and going merge. <laughs> I guess it's like a skit, a very, a very scared act for them. Not scared, scared, but yeah. yeah. I'm gonna miss this ending. Oh no, this is, is this the opening? Yeah, this is the opening. Wait, your dad has a harem? Wait, why do you want to hit up your dad's- wait, what? Noise. Oh my god, I love how there's a dick cloud. Oh, we end with our like kind of OG start, like the traditional kind of start we had. Oh, this just makes me sad that this is over. There's so much, so much stuff in my face. A diverse selection of brothels. Never knew. I never knew this. It could be that this diverse. Like it just keeps going. Just the titties. Oh, okay. Oh, and our boys, just like our gang, our reviewers gang. Oh. This is what I live for. Oh, I don't need that end. Oh, of course we end with um, our kits from Mits Mitsu Mitsui. I can't believe that's it. Our daily Saturday night or Sunday morning, whichever time zone you're in wank time is over it's just you know it's just going to feel so empty now your right hands or your left hands whichever hands you know it could be a lefty as well just yeah it's just going to be a very lonely sunday morning now <laughs> i know i honestly really appreciated this anime like literally all jokes aside i thought it was a bit ridiculous how funimation kind of dropped it like i understand that as like a tv kind of production company you got to keep to like standards and stuff but like i'm pretty sure funimation also did goblin slayer so it's like i don't know i think this is a lot more like consensual actually like educational diverse and like friendly if that makes sense i don't know i'm not gonna get into like all the drama of things i think that's been explored enough but like i genuinely think this anime was a great anime in the sense that it was like really consensual really open it was like light and fluffy and fun and like 
Okay, and yes, I'm not forgetting about all the fantastic fan service as well as species. But I like how it didn't like kink shame, and I think that's a big thing. It's just like, yeah, everything was hella kinky, and like, it's just like everyone has their preferences, and I think Alloy can address that at the end there of just like your scores isn't what matters. It's more just about like the accurate information, so people can kind of find like the right kind of species for them. So I don't know. I think that was kind of a nice kind of touching speech from our number one favorite fairy. So yeah, I'm very doubtful like anyone will pick up season two. I'm kind of hoping like maybe Pornhub hey you know I think season two of interspecies reviews is a great investment I'm just suggesting you know but still like I'm hoping that one day one legendary company will pick up season two and signal all of us legendary cultural people together once again for this educational anime I'm surprised though that for the season finale we didn't end out with like a bang and I mean like a literal bang bang oh yeah I'm also kind of sad that we didn't get to review the demons like actually you know review review the demons but yeah I've had a really great time watching this anime along with you guys and can't thank you guys enough for being on this journey this very cultural journey with me and i hope you guys had had a good time as well if you haven't already do make sure to subscribe so you guys are notified of my next anime shenanigans but yeah until then make sure you guys stay awesome and i'll definitely catch you guys next time